Favorite Chef for Cutter Cooking Program back in the kitchen one more time again, guys. Today, we want to show you can make yourself a nice, lovely, simple, sweet chili fried rice at home. It's amazing, guys, to have this in the kitchen. I'm telling you, you will love it. You know what I mean? Sweet chili sauce and some soy sauce, a little bit of stir fried rice and some veg inside of it. It's just brilliant. So, guys, enjoy it, uh, enjoy it and get a copy of my cooking book online. It's just brilliant, guys. You got the Jamaican rum fruit cake inside of it. I don't know, you will love it. So, enjoy the recipe and hopefully, you will have a wonderful time. See you next time. Bye bye. Nice and lovely. So, for you to make some sweet chili fried rice at home, first of all, you need to use some leftover rice from the day before you will cook if you use it the next day. So, right here, how do I roughly say I have about a hot one and a half cups of basmatic rice which I have left over from the day before. I got some red red sweet pepper right here. I got a mid small tomato which I just cut into four. I got some red onion and some spring onion, some mix, some sweet corn and green peas, soy sauce, olive oil and some sweet chili sauce. To be honest, if you want to add more ingredients towards this, you can. If you like to add more veg, more stuff, you can add it. It's just a sweet chili fried rice, guys, and I know you will love it because something totally different, you know what I mean? It's, the sweet chili might have a little sugar inside of it. If you're allergic to sweetness, well, that's you can have it. If you're allergic to soy sauce, you can have soy sauce. So, guys, I'm just going to simply make a little dish for you. If you have some rice left over from the day before, you don't need to chop it inside of the bin. You can have this as a vegetarian dish. So enjoy the recipe and please leave your comments. Thank you so much. Nice, I love it. So right here, this is my, my little frying pot right now. I'm gonna do my little frying stuff and bits and pieces in. I'm gonna pop a teaspoon of olive oil inside of it. That's the first thing which I wanna do. Then the second thing is to add my lovely veg that which I just cut up. Be careful of the splashing of oil and stuff. So that's the first thing we want to do. And so I'll take out this rope about three to four minutes. So, roughly three minutes now since I've been sauteed and I've wrapped that the veg. Then add the rice. Give it a stir. Um, roughly three tablespoons of sweet corn and green peas mixed together. Give it a stir. So as you can see, it's looking so lovely already at the color and everything. Little bit of soy sauce, not too much. Give it a stir. Um, sweet chili sauce. You can use your favorite sweet chili sauce that you like to use. So roughly fry this for about five to six more minutes. Now this is finished. Sweet chili fried rice. We're gonna share it out now, guys. All I have to do is just to cook it for a nice good ten minutes and. And then sure it's not sweet chili fried rice. It might be a little bit sticky, but it's the best of the best. You can try it at home. And this is just a new recipe from Chef Ricardo. So guys, enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, and please leave your comments as we share it out now. Nice and lovely. So now, 
this is my ball and I'm gonna simply shear it out inside of it just like this suppose you want to put it on the table for your special guest this is one of the best way you could ever do it guys sweet chili fried rice enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching chef for the cooking program we got a lot more recipe like that coming out as you can see looking so lovely and nice sweet chili fried rice enjoy you can go with fried chicken jerk chicken stew chicken Whatever chicken you like curry chicken you can have it just like is it you can have some with some or uh, like some spring roll or some fried prawns whatever you have put prawn in it you can add more stuff to it you can add more veg to it so it's just beautiful and nice and very simple recipe to have at home so enjoy it and see you next time bye bye